All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have made it back to Lake Cumberland. First time in a while. Uh, what's up, everybody? Just to throw it out. Cody's back. Uh, first time taking the boat out in like three months today. We're going to try to hopefully go catch a fish in this thing. It's pretty dirty. Uh, looks like there's stuff floating everywhere. The water looks like chocolate milk. But from what I've been told, people have been catching them here. And we've just been wanting to come back to Cumberland, try to get on these smallmouth again. We'll see what we can do. But uh, me and Cody are gonna get the boat ready and get on the water and we'll catch you out there. All right, boys, we have made it. Cody, I'm gonna take my heated jacket back, please and thank you. Right. Let him use it on the way. I'm gonna wear it right now because that was the coldest run I've had in quite some time. It's only like 50 degrees out right now, which is not too terrible, but when you ran, you know, 10 plus miles at you know, 50, 60 miles an hour straight, it's a little cold, but we are at Lake Cumberland. We're at our first spot. The water looks a little bit better. We kind of ran more towards the dam side. Cody, how you feeling about today? Pretty good. We'll get a couple. I think so. So I don't know what you're starting with. I'm going to start with a rock crawler, I think, and we'll see what happens. We're going to start with this rock crawler here. First cast of the day. Got one? Really? Yeah. Still, that was a bite. That's quick enough. I mean, we've only been fishing for 10 minutes, probably. Fucking rock way down there, just like it went. I'm switching out my shaky head color to black. I feel like this jig is in the way. I feel like you ain't gonna get a box. Oh yeah, it's that great one right there, the waterproof one. So, I'm gonna switch to this, try this out for a little bit. I'm, the next thing I'm gonna throw is gonna be something stupid. Uh, something you've definitely never seen me throw. I saw that bite. Yeah. <laughs> like he let go and I felt it again and he's gone. If we get a bite, I think it'll be a good one. Yeah. Is that you or me? It might have been my mom, though. It was. Good. Hope y'all have a great day. Uh, ooh, that's a bite. That's a good fish. That's a big fish. Big smallie. We're just going to slow play this, and that's a really big smallie. He went on the other side of the boat. I know. Boat. He jumped on the other side of the boat. That's a really big fish. I hope you clipped me calling that out. He's at least three. Uh, it's probably PB, man. Oh my goodness, Cody you means. Looky here, looky Buddy here. boy. All right, I'm putting the shaky head on. Oh, Good fish, dude. Boy. Let's go. Good shit, man. First public body of water fish of the year, and it's like a three pound smallie. Oh man. That's a big smallie, man. That's probably a keeper, I want to say. Yeah. And yeah, if we get one today, it'll be decent. Dude, that's, I mean, that's probably a PB, honestly. I bet he's putting around a flat three or a little over. 285 is what I got to be. Yeah, he's close to 18 and a half. Just for reference, it's an 18 inch board. So he's definitely passed. That's a keeper. Might keep him in the well just to try to get a picture, maybe. We'll do that. Heck yeah, buddy. We breaking PBs already. Calm down. Calm down. Calm, 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 calm. I'm trying to calm down. I'm excited over that. Pretty nice. $2.99. I saw 302 bounce a couple times, but we're going to lock it at $2.99. So, essentially a three pounder. That's a new PB for me. It's not a giant. It's about 18 and a half inches, but that's the biggest smallmouth I have ever caught in my life. So that's awesome. Start the day right. Bro, I have called everything. I know it. <laughs> now, if Cody can break, break his PB today, that'd be interesting video. Just a few more tosses, but I think the shaky head's gonna be the move. Oh, uh, I'm gonna have it on for a while. 
thought I had another one right there. It's tree. <laughs> oh my goodness, Cody. I can't believe that quick, man. New PB on my new rod. First <laughs> boat trip. Okay, guys, we've been fishing roughly 30 minutes. That smallmouth came on just a simple black five inch trick worm on a shaky head. Um, came off of a main lake point, pretty much right off the tip of the point. So that's something to clue in on. We're going to try to put some stuff together, but from what we've been told by a few people, fishing slow is the move right now, which would make sense considering the water is 50 degrees. So, but that's a good start to the day. We'll see what we can do for the rest of it. No shot. That was a bite. It was a bite. He let it go right as soon as I set the hook. I don't know if he felt me or not. Well, is that cueing you to tie on a shaky head, buddy? Yep. <laughs> well, Cody, just to show you. So this is my new rod, guys. It's Dobbins Fury 806, Shimano Corrado 300, 47 gear ratio. Um, so I was throwing this A-rig and stuff of this size on a, a, eight, a seven foot heavy or seven six heavy X-Pride. Don't do that because you're definitely going to break a rod, guys, if you do something like that. But now that I actually have a rod, I just want to show Cody because he hasn't seen it yet how easy it is to cast this thing for. Just a light, normal cast. Damn, it's pretty far. And that's just a normal cast. Like, that was not any effort put into that at all. So, yeah, I'm super happy with it. And then this 4 7 gear ratio helps me keep it slower. All right, just for the sake of trying something different, I'm going to pick up an Ed rig for a minute. Just toss it around. I haven't really fished with the Ned Rig any this year. Well, I guess that's not true, but might as well try it a few times. That's a fish. You got one? That's a good... No, he come off. Oh, my God, dude. I saw it double up. I told you there would be one back here, and I told Bro. you a spinnerbait was a good move back here. I, no, that was definitely I a fish. I set the hook well because he already just went with it. Yeah. Damn, man. That sucks. At least you got to feel one, though, man. I was going to say, it didn't look like it was a super small fish. Insane, dude. Insane. That's right where I started, about where you are. Next yeah. To the limb. He probably chased it for a bit. Probably. Yeah. I'm going to at least fish to the end of this pocket, or like, you know, to the point, and then I don't know. We'll see. I might have to look around some. We might move. Figure scent, Matt. Oh, my God. Oh, fish. Good. Oh, he's not bad. We'll take it. That's a spot. He's probably 12 inches, Cody. Good little fella. Heck yeah. No skunks in the boat today, boys. No, no, no. We'll take him. See if he's 12. I will. I'm curious. I bet he's close. He's probably like 11 and a quarter or something, but he could be 12. I bet he's close. Come here, bud. Pinch his tail. Did he make it? 11 and a half. Nah, 11 and a half. But hey, a That's fish. fish. Awesome. He's chunky, man. He got a little gut on him. Very subtle bite. It felt like you're, you know, scraping rocks, and I was like, eh, there he is. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Ooh. Shiny. Shiny. I'm gonna put a trailer on it. Let's go eat it. That buddy. Yeah. Make screen potion. Just let me shake the fucking hook on a giant, please. I'm about to. No, me. No, you I have. You had your dick. I have the on. <laughs> Holy hell, that's the. Got one? That's a fucking fish, buddy. Kick him off. Oh, man. How are you getting bit so much? I don't know. That seemed like a pretty decent fish, man. Like he was just like, do, 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 and then he just went, Dum. Mm. It may have been a little one then, just yeah. pulling on the tail. Still, that was a bite. Felt kind of, it looked kind of heavy. <laughs> that's your line. You did. Oh, okay. I was like, what the hell? Well, at least it floats. Yeah, true. Yeah, I tried to move my line because he was coming back. I went to move and was quick on the fucking trigger. Quick on the trigger. Like, yeah, there it is. I don't know where I'm going after this, but I'm going somewhere else. I'm going to let you fish now, and I'm going to do my thing. Okay. 
okay? And then format it like that. I'll see you, brother. Later. Bye. Later. Did you miss one a minute ago? I thought you did. Is that fish? No. Hung. All right. Cody caught another fish there, guys. I, sorry, I was taking a business call there. But uh, that was a largemouth, wasn't it? It was. So we caught a grand slam between us. Uh, wasn't a very big one. It was about eight inches or so. But hey, third fish of the day. So we're slowly piecing it together. All right, boys, we're back in action. As I said, had to take a business call, so I let this man run the boat for a little bit. But now I'm back. He just caught one. I'm going to try to one-up him and catch a bigger one, but we'll see what happens. That's a good bill Is it? Yeah. Oh. Grab it with your rod tip now, Cody. Good, don't worry. I think. Just snag it. Try it. I can't believe I see that, dude. I don't go with these games, they I don't believe you are. It's f***ing rigged. See, look. I hope you enjoy this. I really <laughs> like, I know I could do this an easier way, but I'm doing it just for the fact that it makes you laugh. looking out there buddy There's blood on it now we're in trouble we touched no what the f***ing hat on me we got one dumbass cody's new hat guys ain't mine he's taking that home with him giving Someone it to justin they're probably just kidding broke me that was a fish broke me clean all right cody let's move bud where to don't know we are going to find out, and y'all will find out when I find out. Well, boys, we're in a sticky situation now. As you can hear, my motor is not turning over. And we're quite a ways from the ramp. So, we're going to, I'm going to try to start switching over batteries. All right. Let's go. All right, so I got it running guys. So essentially my starting battery died. So I took one of my trolling motor batteries, moved it over, got everything situated and put my starting battery as my other 20, you know, the other 12 volts and my 24 volt for my 24 volt trolling motor. So we're good. All right guys, we made a significant run. Um, the ramp's just over this way here, but we were super far down lake. My starting battery has died, and I switched it over to a starting battery, which, you know, that's just dangerous when starting batteries because they just don't have as much actual power drawn to them at once. So we've run way back up lake close to the ramp so that if we do get stranded, it's not that far away. Water is significantly muddier up here, but me and Cody regardless are going to try to catch a fish we're going to fish this cut probably be last spot of the day but it's not been a terrible day i got one nice fish so i'm okay with it but camp. Oh i can't get over how much muddier this is than where we just were like it's i mean it's a little bit of a run but it's not that far so yeah, I'm I'm think we're both gonna go with he's going with the jig, I'm going with the spinner bait, and we're gonna try that here. Dead ass. Big one. Big one, Cody. Big fish. Oh, I thought I lost it. Big one. Yes. Sir. Might be bigger than the other. He definitely is. Oh, please don't come off. Oh my God, Cody. Oh my God, Cody. Yes! In the net, baby! Oh my God. That one's bigger, Cody. Oh, it came off in the net. I was so scared. I thought you fucked it up. Oh my gosh. She's bleeding a little bit. Let me, let me dip her. Hold on. 
Oh my God, Code, dude, annihilated it. That's a big one. Look how pale that fish is. That's three and a half, four, gotta be. Oh my goodness. What a rush. You wouldn't believe it. That's only like a night, maybe 19 and a quarter. It's not that much bigger than that other one lengthwise, but man, it's heavy. I thought it popped off. I did too. When it first so, no, caught on the net. I was like, I will never be forgiven. I'm done. Oh my God, Cody. Four? No. 370. Oh my God, Cody, that's a giant. I know. Oh my goodness. Well, let's put that one in the well for a little bit here. I can't believe that. Did you slow roll it or fast roll it, but literally as soon as it hits the ball. Pretty much, I got like maybe two cranks and, and she just had it, man. So guys, I've broken my PB twice today now. That one was 370. About a 19, 19 a quarter inch smallmouth. I'm gonna try to catch another one. Dude, this place is so beautiful though. Like this lake, just scenery yeah, wise, man. I love, like guys, look at this. Like you, you don't get this anywhere else, but lakes like Cumberland, you know, Beaver, Laurel. It's the only place you see stuff like this. It's beautiful. We're gonna fish this and then we're done because I just can't. No trolling motor, that's what I have to call it. So we'll fish this, and then we're going to get the heck out of here. It's been a tough day, but good for me. Hey, you caught some fish at least. I mean, like, I, I, I mean, I wish you had caught a good one so far, too. I mean, you still got some time, but, like, at least you caught a couple fish. Like, it could have been worse. I could have had you jumping in the lake today. Yeah. You want to jump in the lake, Cody? No, I do not. All right, boys. So we're getting off the water here. I'm gonna get a couple videos of these fish, get a couple of pictures, and let these fish go. So a 299 and a 370 both have been my PB at some point today. Like I say, we're gonna get a couple pictures. I'm gonna get some measurements on this bigger one because I may end up getting a fake mount on it. Then we're gonna let them go. All right, guys, now we're going to let these two beautiful smallmouth go. Start with the smaller one. Right at three pounds. Very big fish. 18 and a half. There she goes. And then the big one, 370, my new PB. 19 and a half inches long. There she goes. All right, fellas, we're off the water. We're both tired. I've had many boat problems today. Broke two PBs. Uh, that's a first for me. Cody caught a couple. We thought we were gonna like, maybe be lucky to get a bite today. So I think we're pretty happy. I'm happy with the day. I mean, you caught a couple, how do you feel? Pretty good. I just glad to get out. It's been a while since what, November? Yeah, it's been like November since we got to fish together. So we're just happy to get out here and get on the water and provide you all some new content. It feels like it's been forever, like I said, since we've posted anything new. So, yeah, we're pretty happy about it. He's eating some pecans from Bucky's. Uh, we're gonna head to the house though, and we'll catch you all the next time out. And please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you.